Hello, I'm excited to show you a demo today of managed open search on DigitalOcean. Open search allows you to ingest, store, and analyze telemetry from your resources at DigitalOcean and elsewhere. In this demo, we'll cover creating an open search cluster, forwarding logs from another managed Postgres cluster, and viewing the logs in your open search dashboard. Let's get started on the Create Database Cluster page. We will first select the region we want to create our cluster in, choose a VPC network, and then select the new open search engine. From here, we have a number of different database configurations. We have basic shared CPU plans, general purpose dedicated CPU plans, and memory optimized dedicated CPU plans. I'm going to go ahead and select a general purpose dedicated CPU plan. I'll choose my plan, select the number of nodes that I want, and I also can adjust the storage size of the cluster from the base level storage that's already provided for the cluster. I'm going to increase this slightly. Finally, I can assign a cluster name or leave it as the default assigned, select a project that I want my cluster to be in, assign any tags to the cluster, and then review my total costs and go ahead and create it. Let's create it. While that's creating, I already have an existing cluster that's ready for us to use. In here, you can see we can launch the OpenSearch dashboard for the cluster to go ahead and utilize the UI. Furthermore, I have created another cluster, a Postgres cluster, that is forwarding logs to the existing OpenSearch cluster. When launching the OpenSearch dashboard UI, we can see that logs are being forwarded from our PG source cluster our open search sync cluster. Going back to the open search cluster that already exists, we can go to settings, cluster configuration, and see that we can change our plan using different plan sizes, different node sizes, as well as adjusting the storage size. I'm going to go ahead and change to a memory optimized dedicated CPU plan with three nodes and increase the storage also as well. I can review the cost details and save. While the cluster is scaling and adjusting the plan size, it is still available for use. Going back to my Postgres cluster, the source cluster that was forwarding logs to OpenSearch, I can see a variety of log forwarding destinations that it is forwarding to under the settings page. We can see that it is forwarding to a couple different destinations, and we can create new destinations for it to forward to as well. Thank you very much.